What's up you guys? It's Danielle. Um, today I'm going to be showing you how I make my broccoli alfredo fettuccine. It's super easy with very few ingredients to make. Um, you, it'll be done in about mm, maybe 30 minutes or less. So yeah, right here I'm just showing you the ingredients that I have. My heavy whipping cream, some shredded parmesan, and some minced garlic. First, we are gonna start off with a pot of boiling water, season that with salt, and then going to add our fettuccine noodles. And at the same time, I also steamed the broccoli, but <laughs> somehow I forgot to record it. But, you know, steaming broccoli is super easy to make. You can, like if you have a frozen bag, you can pop it into the microwave and steam it like that. Or on your rice cooker, there's so many ways that you can steam it. <laughs> I'm going to add about a heaping tablespoon of ghee to my very hot skillet because I forgot I turned it on and you will see in a minute that the garlic <laughs> was frying up too fast or sauteing too fast excuse me going to add our minced garlic. Uh, again, I added two big heaping tablespoons of minced garlic to the ghee and you're going to saute that until it's like kind of brownish and fragrant. whipping cream I'm first adding two cups and then later on I added like um, maybe about a cup more to the sauce now that we have our heavy whipping cream in the pan we are going to carefully whisk the ghee and the whipping cream together until it's well blended Okay guys, you see how we did that. Now that is well blended together, let's bring it up to a small boil. While our alfredo sauce is cooking, we're gonna check on our noodles, which they should be done by now, and also the broccoli, so let's go ahead and strain those. Okay you guys, I'm so sorry for the poor quality lighting right here. But you can kind of see in the shadow that the sauce has come to a boil. And then we're gonna slowly add our Parmesan cheese a little bit at a time and whisk that all together until it's, you know, well blended and creamy. And I only used about like 75% of this container. I believe it was only like 10 ounces. So yeah, I only used about 75% of it. pepper, a little bit of garlic powder, and some parsley.
sauce and broccoli is done. Um, these next steps is kind of optional to you guys because I know some people don't like it mixed, but uh, myself and my family, we do like it mixed. So I just top the noodles with the steamed broccoli. And then next I am going to take our Alfredo sauce and pour it over the broccoli. <laughs> everything together with our tongs and then we will be done. it off with a little bit more um, parmesan cheese and some um, parsley to give it that nice little presentation but this is the end of today's video I hope you guys enjoyed it please don't forget to subscribe hit the like button share it comment that really helps my channel a lot thank you guys until next time bye Thank you.